family, it's Chrissy with the Mobile Home Diva. And in today's video, I'm going to be touring the Cottonwood by Destiny Homes. Now this is a beautiful home. I'm super excited to show it to you. I'm gonna just walk outside, let you see what the outside looks like, and then we'll come on in and we'll tour this home. the cottonwood here this is the cottonwood by destiny homes i'm so excited to tour this home simply because i don't think that i have ever toured a destiny homes not that i can remember if i have you guys some of my long timers put it down in the comment section if you've seen a destiny home on my channel i've toured so many homes before but this this is i'm excited i'm excited just from seeing some of the features in the home uh i'm super excited to show you to show you this home i'm out here at cordell homes custom homes of cordell in cordell georgia this is a three bedroom two bath home it's the lot model now if you're interested in this model it's not available it's actually under contract but this home can be ordered again this is custom homes of cordell georgia this is a three bedroom the cottonwood is a three bedroom two bath home it's actually 32 by 64 if you're interested in those numbers any specifications that i have will certainly be in this video but let's go on in and see what she looks like all right this is the view that you see when you walk into the home, really nice, super nice. I'm gonna spin you around and let you see the entryway. What I like about the entryway, what I like about the home, first of all, is that I don't see any carpet. Okay, so that is a plus for me, but I like the separation of having an actual entryway. So you have this wall here that divides the living room from the entry you've got a place to put keys and whatnot you got an area to create additional space for your entry whether you want to do a bench or a table of some sort or even either put a i could see a high back chair and a table here next to the outlet with a lamp on it i mean it's really up to you going over into your living room area again as i stated no carpet in here that is excellent you've got an entertainment center here and a lot of times you guys when you have this space in the middle they they don't make it big enough for you to put the size tv that you would want but I could see a 65 or a 75 inch TV up there easily. You've got these really nice built-ins on either side. You've got lots of space for um, whatever you want. Uh, movies, games, uh, other electronics. It's really up to you. Books, uh, albums, vinyls. It's really up to you. And you've got a lot of space here to decorate whether you have a lot of furniture or a little bit of furniture. You've got a lot of space here to be comfortable. Ceiling fan comes standard in here. Vents in the ceiling is standard in here. Really nice light colored vinyl flooring in this room. And then it's open to the dining room and the kitchen. So you've got all of this natural light coming in the house, whether it's the three large windows in the living room or these two large windows here in the dining room space. You've got a lot of natural light coming into this place. Love the colors in here. 
You've got a slightly darker color on the walls in the kitchen than you do in the dining room. So that's a nice contrast. We'll get to the kitchen in a minute, but just look at all the space that you have in this dining room. And I love the fact that they have uh, the pen, the, not pendant lighting, those cap lights in here. Really nice. Really, really nice. Love uh, the tray ceiling over the island. They don't have the pendant lights up, but I can just, I can just see it in here over this huge, huge island. Really lovely. You've got uh, the, this is stainless steel. I forget the color, but this is the darker gray stainless steel. Really lovely. Ceramic uh, stove top. Uh, again, this is stainless steel. It's just in that darker gray color. Really, really nice. Love all the cabinets. Love the color. The antique white cabinet space. You've got glass tile as the backsplash really lovely and again you've got drywall in here you've got uh finished drywall and this drywall is painted a slightly darker more of a taupe versus the beige that's in the living room um so really nice really nice feature you've got this window that opens over your sinks really really lovely really lovely really nice love the we'll get to the price the price is on the refrigerator but let's take a look at all of the features in the house first you got this pantry space here which is always a nice plus to have they haven't opened these oh look at me trying to open it individually that's cute how they did it this is one big space you guys I don't know if we have lighting in here. Nope, we don't have lighting in here, but you can see that this pantry is deep. So that's really lovely. They got three shelves and the shelving goes all the way around. I hope you can see it. It's coming in clear from me looking at it on the screen, but I hope you can see it. Really nice. You've got a, a, a light in here, so you have plenty of light and there's lots of space even on the floor for additional storage. So this is really lovely. I I appreciate that it looks like a part of the cabinetry, but it's actually a door. What a nice surprise. I came in here originally thinking that those were separate cabinets. So really nice. Nice use of space. You got a lot of a lot of pantry space in there. People don't even know that it's a pantry. It just looks like a part of the kitchen. So really lovely, really lovely. Let's go take a look at the laundry room while we're here in the kitchen. So your laundry is, room is here by the back door. That's your back door there. Your washer and dryer will go here. And then look at all of this space that you have for additional shelving, um, to, for storage, for a deep freezer, for a little nook, uh, computer nook to do bills or the kids do homework, just whatever you choose for it to be. So very nice. I'm standing over by the dryer and you have all of that space over there for whatever you would like for it to be. Right off the kitchen, really lovely really lovely all right again this is glass tile this isn't that fake stuff this is actually clear tile against this color wall so that's really really nice really nice all right let's get another look at the kitchen and living room and dining room from this area super lovely we're gonna walk through past the dining room and look at the additional bedrooms. Down this hall, you have your additional bedrooms. To the right, you have bedroom number one. Again, if I get the, if I, they had the door lock, you, you're not even able to go in. I had to call a number and get permission to view this home. So I'm gonna have to look online again and see if they have, all the measurements and stuff. But this is a walk-in closet. 
And again, this is bedroom number one. I'm standing in the closet. <clears throat> Give you an idea of how much space you have. And then to the right, you have your additional bedroom number two. Now the first bedroom had one window. This one is on the opposite corner. It has two. It's slightly larger than the first one and also has a walk-in closet. All right, so both bedrooms have a walk-in closet, which is always super nice to have multiple walk-in closets in a house. So you have lots of space for storage. And then to the right of this bedroom and across from the other one, you have the guest bath. So this is your second bathroom. You've got double sinks in here and lots of space for storage. Now these are actually cabinets, just like in the kitchen. So you have all of this. You can use this for multiple purposes. It could be uh, hygiene items, linen closet, towels, sheets, storage, just whatever you need it to be. I'll open up one of the, the uh, sections and let you see how much space you have in there really nice and you've got six sections here so that is really nice all right and then in the second part of the bathroom you have the tub and shower combo you have a window that actually opens and you have your toilet and it also comes with the towel rack and the toilet holder which is rare because normally you have to get those things yourself once you purchase the home so this is the additional, the second bathroom. Lots of space in here for guests, for your kids, for your family, for your friends that live here with you. You have all of the space. Love how they brought the backsplash in here. And also the darker color um, is in this bathroom like it is in the kitchen, but the lighter color is on the outside so again super nice contrast now last but not least we are going to view the master the master is on this side of the house so you have all of this space as the master the master also comes with two big windows and a ceiling fan like the living room really really nice i'll come over here give you another view of the master and how big it is. You've got your master closet inside the master and not inside the bathroom. So all of this space is your master closet. Really lovely. Again, they don't have lights on in here, so forgive, it, forgive me for it being dark. But look at this, all of this space is master closet. All of it is master closet. I'm gonna go on this side. So you've got all of this space. This is your master. This is as big as a bedroom, you guys. There's some bedrooms that size. Really lovely. Over here, you have your master bath. You've got frosted glass over the tub, which is a super nice and super comforting. There's the backsplash again around this huge soaker tub. Love the fact that you've got the built-in shelving in this bathroom. Really lovely. You can give it a nice spa feel. You've got two sinks as well as a makeup table complete with mirror in this master bed bathroom. You've got all of this cabinet space under each sink. Really nice, really, really nice. And then over here, you've got more storage. Just now, this is a wider cabinet than the other room, but you've, you've got all of the space and you have the shelving in there too. So really lovely. Toilet is here. This window doesn't have frosted glass. This window actually opens 
And then you've got your walk-in shower here. They've got it taped up, so I won't mess with that. But you've got a uh, beautiful tile in there. You've got the rain shower, shower head. There's that tile. And you've got a nice bench in there where you can be comfortable. Really nice. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Now, this is the Cottonwood, you guys, by Destiny Homes. Really lovely home. Really nice. Love all the features in this home. This home, this lot model, which includes delivery set up within a 50-mile radius. They do charge overage if it's over 50 miles to deliver. It includes the trim out, the steps to the exterior doors, Vinyl skirting, if you don't want brick. The uh, AC unit, all the appliances, and it includes the furniture. The price of this home, you guys, is $140,000 plus tax. Okay? So there's your price for the Cottonwood lot model. Now, if you place an order, you place an order for this home, you get additional upgrades. You get extras like brick and things of that nature. Of course, it's going to be more. Now, if you have questions about this home, all of the information that I have on this home, including the location and a contact person, will be down in the description box. I do not work for uh, Custom Homes of Cordell. I tour these homes because I love touring these homes. And so I hope you enjoyed um this tour if you have any questions about this home pricing specification location adding uh upgrades any questions make sure you use the information in the description box below okay thanks so much for watching see you in the next video